प्लीज डाउनलोड टेलीगो स्टॉप एंड्रॉइड एप इन प्ले स्टोर और आई ओ एस एप इन एप स्टोर एंड स्टे ट्यून टू लेटेस्ट न्यूज एज इट है द रूलिंग वाई एस आर कांग्रेस पार्टी इन आंध्र प्रदेश विच हैड सो फार नॉट स्पेल्ट आउट देर स्टैंड ऑन द कंटेंशियस यूनिफॉर्म सिविल कोड यू सी सी हैव एश्योर्ड द मुस्लिम कम्युनिटी दैट दे वुड अपहोल्ड द इंटरेस्ट ऑफ द माइनॉरिटी कम्युनिटी चीफ मिनिस्टर यस जगन मोहन रेड्डी गेव द एश्योरेंस टू अ मुस्लिम डेलीगेशन ऑन वेन्सडे द नाइनटींथ ऑफ जुलाई अ डे बिफोर द कमेंसमेंट ऑफ पार्लियामेंट्स मॉनसून सेशन The BJP-led National Democratic Alliance (NDA) union government is likely to table a bill in this regard in parliament during the session that commenced on Thursday. The YSRCP's support would be crucial for the NDA while introducing the UCC bill. YSRCP has 22 members in the Lok Sabha and 9 in the Rajya Sabha. The TDP has 3 in the Lok Sabha and 1 member in the upper house. While meeting Muslim leaders on Wednesday, YSRCP Supremo and Chief Minister Yas Jagan Mohan Reddy promised that they would not do anything that would hurt the sentiments of the minority community. Jagan's assurance: This is your government working for the interests of the weaker sections and minorities, and it will not take any decision that will hurt your sentiments. Don't get unduly worried, Jagan told the Muslim representatives. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has been pushing for the implementation of the UCC. saying different sets of laws for different communities did not augur well for the country and they were not sustainable jagan said the union government was yet to prepare the draft ucc bill further he stated that a false narrative was being propagated regarding muslim women's rights and suggested that religious heads and elders should reject it affirming that there would be no compromise on the rights of muslim women he sought suggestions from the representatives noting that different personal law boards were working based on their faiths and religious practices Jagan said if these practices were to be streamlined it should be done through personal law boards as they have a fair idea and understanding he said only these boards were competent enough to avoid misinterpretation if these are to be changed the supreme court law commission and the union government should discuss the issues with various law boards and work on their proposals otherwise it may not work in a country like india which is guided by diversity he added Muslim population in Andhra Pradesh the Muslims comprise only around 7.33% of the state's total population they are unevenly distributed and concentrated mostly in a few pockets especially in Rayalaseema and coastal Andhra districts the Rayalaseema region sends more than 50 MLAs to the state assembly and the region is important for any political party in the state the 2011 census data published in 2015 put the muslim of population in Andhra at 3,617,713 The state's total population is 49,386,799. The percentage of Muslims in Andhra Pradesh is lower than the national average of a 14.2%. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.